Hello, hello. We are live. One minute early. <sighs> hey, Waskels. Thank you for the three month sub. I appreciate it. Give me that prime money. <clears throat> We're up to seven now. Doing all right. Ooh, we've got new features on um, MTG Tool. MTG Arena Tool. Looks like we can do overlays and things like that. Oh, actually, I think we could already do overlays. We'll have to... Uh, We'll have to mess around with that at some point, get the overlays going. How am I doing today? I'm doing okay, thank you. How are you? I'm just going to have a little look at my sideboard again, make sure that I'm reasonably happy with it. I think I am. I think I am. I'm not sure whether Elder Spell needs to be in the main board, to be honest. But, uh, I'm going to stick with it, just in case. Made Chinese chicken curry. Very nice. I had um, tikka masala today. Mountain of Nambra, that chat was really dry. It wasn't very nice. Yeah. Kinda wanna try and get a second hostage taker in there. Thinking maybe take out the cast down, but I'm not sure. Keep going anyway for now. Need to update my deck. Yeah, I tried the mountain and arm, but it wasn't good. <laughs> it was not good. Steam is finally alive, yeah, I had to like click to featured and then click back again. Or click to explore and then click back to featured. <clears throat> cool, All right, that's done. Let's go again. I'm still trying to figure out this side, but oh god no, the overlays are back. That's exactly what I didn't want. Uh, show overlay. Don't want them. Not yet anyway. We'll get we'll get something. Doesn't like me looking at my wish list. Yeah, it'll be it'll be dodgy for a little while, I think. It normally is. to shuffle in real life whilst I am waiting for this to go. Uh, yeah, we'll keep this. <clears throat> We've got the play. So we probably want to go and get this watery grave down first. All the others are checks, so let's we'll try our best here to, to get this down. Um, let's go uh, Glacial Fortress and go Fort Erasure. <clears throat> See what he's got. Chattercross, Ogre Bolas. Um, I 
think we'll go get rid of the auger and this can go to the bin. We got enough land. The opts, of course. I wasn't going to get rid of the opt. It's fair enough. Then we see charter course, of course. There's the phoenix to the bin. So we know that's coming. Uh, can he realistically get out... How many how spells does he have to play? He has to spell, play three or more with two land, maybe three. He would have to have three individual spells. I don't think he can do it. So we'll get an asset down and try to stop him drawing cards. Take it to Fairy. Very nice. I'll do. Ogre Bolas comes down, yeah. Sure. Before action. Wait, Barry. Trust me. You'll thank me. Respect his hand. He will get a spell off that, but that's that's okay by me. If he just wants to play two land and keep things in hand, I just want to get this to fairy down on the next turn, and uh, my baby to fairy protects me from that, even if he manages to burn it. There goes the shock. There goes the ogre bolus. Okay. Short. We get the old. We, we definitely get the Teferi here and we just tick it up. We're not interested in putting that all back to, to his deck. Quickly. I've got time. Um, and we'll do. We've got mana up for Tyrant Scorn as well now. Just in case he decides he wants to. Uh, he wants to try and challenge this to Fairy, which I wouldn't blame him. Yep, there we go. Cool. He plays that from hand. I'll let that resolve. Um, I'm pretty fine with letting this die. It's this I want to get rid of, I think, because I can kill... No, probably not. No, probably not. Teferi can take one. I think this needs to go back to his hand. No more we'll keep both Teferis that way. Um, let's play the isolated chapel. Let's tick this up one. Let's see let's what we get. Good okay, we get a D spark, which deals with the which deals with the, the arc light phoenix on the next drop. That's great. Um, I'll protect you. And then we can play this, and we can play basilica. Forces him to discard something, and then we will go for the, the D spark. So he thinks he can do the three spells this turn, which might be a case. Might be the case. <coughs> okay, lava coil. So he can, he's got his opt. He can do his opt as well. Then he has what a shock or something? Maybe a shock. Oh, he's got his extra land. Okay, sure. <clears throat> Maybe I shouldn't have thrown that back to his hand then. Maybe that wasn't such a good idea. He gets his two Arc Light Phoenix back. Yeah, it probably wasn't such a good idea. So we're both going to go for the big Teferi. We can get rid of one. Go 
three takes three. <clears throat> okay, uh, we can get Liliana down here. So we'll see Hold that thought. what we get first. Got to be careful here. I don't really want to force him to discard that again. Kind of want to go. Yeah, I'll go hero. Get this down. Hey, Baka, how you doing, man? Um, and I'm going to get both of Kaya down to get rid of the bolus. this. Yeah, and then I was going to use that to put back to his hand. Because it's much harder for him to get rid of it out of his hand. Well, not harder as such, but if I just make him discard it, it's obviously not good. But um, he needs to have, like, he needs to have, have his draw and discard spells at the ready. Um, so we can get rid of Elder Spell. We can go double D-Spark. Um, we... Titan Scorn's okay here, but I think maybe Cast Down would be a little bit better. Earth of Kyra Mortifying. I don't, I don't think we need Titan Scorn. Keep Cast Down. Three Earth of Kyra, the Mortify. Um, then we have the D Spark for the bigger creatures. Um, we can probably assume the Commander Dreadhorde isn't any good here. Go double Lyra, get those flying blockers up. Um, and then I think maybe mo remove a Teferi for Enter the God Eternals and a, Basil a Basilica for a Hostage Taker. Jurassic in, don't I? I think the hero's out. And go double Jurass. And double Kaya's Wrath. Yeah, that gives me enough stuff, I think, that's against this uh, against this build. <coughs> Okay, that gives us Thought Erasure and Cast Down. We can keep that. Double Thought Erasure. Maybe top lane. I'll grab all this. I can stay on the field for a while. I'd rather get these uh, Thought Erasures down. We've got five land. Uh, ditch this Narset. Um, into the God Eternals can probably stay there. So I'm hoping the next Thought Erasure will draw out the negate from him. Personally, I'd like to be able to pick, but I managed to get rid of the Narset there, which is incredibly powerful, so not too worried. I expect this will draw a draw a negate. It did not. Um, I think this has to go. That's such a powerful draw. And then we'll go Hallowed Vow now tapped. And we might be able to draw out the negate with the cast down. Uh, sorry, the negate with the cast down rather. But I doubt it. I doubt that's going to happen. I think what's more likely going to happen is he's going to try and get rid of Narset. I think we have to try. Oh, he he uh, he's overcommitted. He's overcommitted. If you wish to surrender now, I have just the trick for this. <clears throat> So 
So do I take Kai's Wrath or do I take D-Spark? He's got one Phoenix in the grave. Pretty sure. One Phoenix in the grave. I think we take the D spark. The problem with him having the gate is he has to like burn everything. There's the lightning strike that comes out. You still have much to learn. He has to burn all his land to actually get ahead here. Blocker down, get some land going. Some life going, rather. <clears throat> Not land. Right, we're back up to 19. That's good. We've got our land down. We've managed to stabilize a bit. We've got some big spells in hand. Okay, the finales of promises. The lightning strike. He draws some cards. He puts a land to the bin. What else has he got? Has he got a shock? Got a shock in hand? So take three, four, five. So how do I play this? He's got that negate manner up. Um, I think maybe. Because if I, if I throw it into the God Eternals here, he just negates and he gets another free turn, whereas I can actually weave in a D spark here if I'm lucky. If I'm really lucky, he'll negate the cast down on the attack by reflex. Sure. I think he'll negate this. He did not. Fine. But I'm fairly sure he's going to negate the D spark. So he wants that 3 damage. He doesn't want to see this go. So I'll take the three now. That leaves him with no land up. Um, then I can enter the God Eternals. I'm going to mill myself because I really don't want him having more phoenixes in the graveyard. And then on the next turn, I can drown Katakun. Uh, not drunk, I took I could Teferi rather. <laughs> I could Teferi. Um, so I milled myself there so that he wouldn't get more stuff in the graveyard. Um, I assume he's got some kind of. Yeah. Zappy boy there. Okay, yeah. That makes 
makes sense. Uh, and then I think we probably maybe took this. I am not going to sit this one out. I mean, we probably took that and... Not so fast. See where we get to. Give me a card. No time for a break. What have we got? Right, let's see if we can get NASA down. Might not. He's got something. Just don't know what he's got. He might just have another gate. Okay. Ooh, prowess. lift. It's a bit of a shame. Um. I will pass. Hold up my D-Spark and Hostage Taker. He's drawing land, which probably isn't great. Pass. My turn. Okay, let's draw a card. See, see what all of our options are first. Keep an open mind. So like a get rid of something in his hand. And then I'm gonna hold the hostage taker for this this three cost thing. Um Wait, has this got haste? That has got haste, but it's got flying. So I can't really block that. Start to at least apply some pressure now. Just in case he just randomly has enough. <clears throat> we might lose to Fairy here. Who's Nasa? Oh, maybe he's got a draw spell. Not prepared for this. No? Okay. You know what? I'm not done yet. Hostage taker working in our favour, which is great. We cast into a sorcery spell, which you control. That's what this one's hit. Okay, and he is a wizard here. Yeah. She? She. Okay. we got four mana up. We've got D Spark in hand. We can use Earthkaya to clear the way later. <coughs> Looking pretty good so far. Not impossible for him to win this, but it's going to take a lot of work. It's going to need a lot of stuff. Yeah, there we go. Back up to plat one, guys. Look at that. 
<coughs> GG. A hostage taker coming in clutch there. Yeah, good job. Good job. Only because of your presence. <laughs> uh, I wonder whether. Do I think I can get another hostage taker in that sideboard? Hey Ross, how you doing, man? How am I doing? Uh, I'm doing okay. We just won our first match. Hey Sink, how you doing, mate? Banging drill on stream. Do you like my drill recommendations, lad? Does it make you feel like a G? Uh, I kind of really want to get another hostage taker in here, but I don't know if it's worth it. Maybe one's just the right amount. Especially at the moment with the amount of burn knocking around. Maybe one is just the right amount. Can you imagine if I played like Drill on stream and then got copyright claimed? How gangster is that? Yeah, we're, we're doing okay, Ross. We've uh, we just we played our first match. We won it, um, fair and square. You know, pretty good. Had good news today as well. What did you? What happened? Tell me, tell me more. Trims will come round to your house. <laughs> Times you like. What a beast. 5k increase. Very nice. Very nice. So, does that mean you're not going for uh, the other job, or is this part of a new job? <clears throat> no longer looking. So, they kept you. They managed to convince you. Good stuff. Wow, we. That's uh, special, isn't it? <clears throat> this is going to take forever and a day to come out. And he hasn't got the land. He needs triple red and triple blue. And he's only got two red and three blue. And a green. So Sinister Sabotage is going. Uh, yeah, I want to keep that land for my Basilica. So Narset's going to be slightly late here. I'm okay with that, really. Maybe should have gone Narset actually, because he might just play his extra land and drop Chemisters. Yeah. Hey Memphis, how you doing man? Good to see you mate. What did he drop to the bin? So he dropped one of his lands to the bin. So this is going to take forever to come out. Yeah, he's, he's going to do Chemisters. I, sh I should have gone Narset I think. I think Narset was probably a better play there. Take a big Teferi. Get the old Godless Shrine going. Uh, so what's he on? He's on four. So we want to try and tuck this back to his deck, I think. Unless we get a baby Teferi, in which case put it back to his hand. Games are going alright today, mate. Uh, we've only played one so far, um, but we won it pretty, pretty cleanly, which was nice. So he puts another land to the bin. He's done pretty well here. Got plenty of cards in hand. But he can't use his jump start on Chemist's Insight yet. He's playing like a really weird combination of colours. I find very interesting. Uh, da -da -da -da. Growth Spiral. Okay, sure, mate. It's baby to fairy. So we'll go for a hero, and then we'll go for a baby to fairy, and we'll bounce, search for his counter back to his hand. We got this really lucky before and got rid of both of his uh, this might be a bad idea. His counter spells. There's another baby to fairy, Lil T. 
<clears throat> well, yeah, we're doing okay, man, Foss. We're doing okay. Only one game, but we can get there. Here goes nothing. So he's got his card for the turn. Deals us one damage, so he'll get rid of. Yeah, he'll get rid of an asset. And then we exile him. We just gotta make sure we get rid of him, because he's a bit of a nightmare. Right, let's ping him. Start pushing him low. Paradise. Gain two life. Okay. Sure. And then what? Then what does he do? Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. This. I was gonna say I had I had lethal on forward like what's he waiting for? Uh, okay, so didn't see any planeswalkers. Tyrant scorn not really that useful. Command the dreadhard might come in useful. I think we want to get the D sparks in. We'll probably get the hostage taker in the double duress. Incoming gate colossal, or is he not running gates? I didn't see him running gates. It didn't look like he was running gates. It just looked like he was running loads of basics. But I wasn't paying attention to his land after a certain point. So maybe maybe he was, maybe he wasn't. Um, what do we get rid of here? Mortify stays in, I think. Um, I think maybe the hostage taken not so good here actually. Keep, we got the, we got the double duress. That's what makes the difference. Um, I th think I'll probably take out an oath of Kaya for a Dovin's veto, and that gives me some level of counter spell and all that kind of business. Yeah, I can protect a fairy because I know he's got counter spells. And he's probably just going to throw loads of them in now. We've played against this kind of build before, where it's like, right, my sideboard is basically entirely counter spells. This is absolutely fine. Whoa, the immediate opt. He didn't even wait till the end of turn. Straight in there with the opt. Search for a scanter. Okay. Yeah, that's fine. Precinct one. Oh, okay, he's Nexus. Yeah, he's Nexus. It's a paradise. Taps out. That's fine. Right on schedule. That's more like it. In. Had two mana really close. So he's got four mana here. So he's really gonna go he's gonna go heavy for this uh <clears throat> what's it called? This Niv Mizzet, isn't he? He's got the Niv Mizzet, I think. Trust me, I have a plan. My brow is I have just the trick for this. 
Take a duress, already got a Teferi in hand. What have you got? Okay. Uh, yeah, I mean, he's playing Wilderness Wreck. Just get rid of that and win. GG. <laughs> Sometimes that happens. If you're in the second game and the guy's about to, like, discard, like, your main combo piece that you're going to deploy next turn. Um, sometimes it is just like insta concede. Right, I'll just move on to the next match and pick myself up. But yeah, that was. Um, I feel like that was the right play. Picking up. Saw I had the one mana up. Picked that extra duress up. And just mess with his hand a little bit. We already had the Teferi in hand, so we didn't really need another threat. Not against a deck like that. Made the right move, not putting in. Um, Hostage Taker as well, because he's just basically got no creatures whatsoever. He's just got that one in his I guess. So that puts us at 2-0. <clears throat> two more game, two more wins and we go up. Hands are looking really good today. We've got some really good hands. Even won some games on the play today as well. Wow. We get that ratio away from 0%. Okay, so he's playing Drakes. We've seen a lot of Drakes recently. I think everyone's getting their Drakes fix in before it inevitably dies off. <clears throat> Another land off the top would be good next. He may just decide to get rid of this. I'd be surprised if he doesn't have a bolt of some kind. Yeah, there we go. That takes one bolt out of his hand anyway. Stop hitting those planeswalkers. Okay. Thought Erasure. Let's play that then. Um, Get rid of... <laughs> what is this hand? Two, two, so you have three lightning strikes and two crackling drakes in hand. Um, That can probably go to the bin. Not interested in that. We went up. Yep. Yeah, we're gonna try. We're gonna try our best. So against the crackling drake. As expected. We need to land off the top. Boom. Okay, that's nice. Um I'm known for my excellent timing. Spark. Here we go. Nice, got a D spark. Need more land please, deck. But not too much. But not too much. <laughs> Just enough. At the right moment. <laughs> no, I am not making this up as I go. Up the movie, yeah. <laughs> uh So I think what we do is we actually pay the two life for this and then I can make a decision on the next turn whether I want a Tyrant Scorn and despark or whether I want to Mortify. It depends whether he has like the the stuff to to go off, right? <clears throat> Cause you got Torment and Voice there. So I guess he, as long as he draws a land, like, he's good, right? How many I got two Phoenix in the bin. This is gonna go badly. Yeah, he gets the lightning strike off. I really should have seen that coming. And then he probably just bolts me in the face. Bolts me in the face. Oh, he's gonna go for another torment and voice. Okay, sure. Uh, this is the biggest thing. It's uh, if I get rid of this, I'm getting rid of the most damage off the field. Um, so I think we can get rid of this. Yes, we're going to see two arc like Phoenixes here, but you never know, we might... You know, we can't talk to another D-Sparks, we can have one in, but... Uh, get rid of... Exile, exile at least one of these so we can't just 
spark it himself. He can't just lightning strike it himself. Because <clears throat> sometimes you'll go exile and they'll go, eh, lightning strike my own creature, put it to my own bin, you know. Let's see what he does here. the right move actually. rid of it before his draw step. So he'll probably just smash out Arc like Phoenix here, I think. He's got so much land and so much stuff in hand, I can't really see how he win this, to be honest, but we shall see. We shall see. Hits me for three. What else has he got? That, of course. Draw some cards. Yep. It's an extra land down. He's just totally fueled up. Totally fueled up. Um, we pretty much have to Teferi and tuck this back to his deck. Choice. I won't hide from the world. Let's take it. Back. Texting me. Damn. Oh, I was just tweeting notifications. One damage. <laughs> we got there. We got one damage to his face. Free version of Netflix. Shall I reenact up for every subscriber? <coughs> Uh, okay, finale of promise, yeah. yeah, yeah. And then he uses that to zap to fairy. And then draws to his cards, plays the Phoenix, hits me in the face. Oh, I guess he's, he just plays Kefnet, doesn't he? Yeah, he plays Kefnet and then I like the Phoenix comes to the. comes to the grave. Uh, yeah, that's GG, I think. We can see what we get. I don't think it's going to kill everything, I whatever we've everything. got. Ooh, that would have killed everything. Damn, that's a bit of a shame. GG. Right, let's go to the second round. Let's get all our life gain in. Hero doesn't really work against this deck, neither does the Elder Spell. We can get our D-Sparks in, we'll get our um, Hostage Taker in into the God Eternals. We go Double Kai's Wrath. Um, and we want to get Lyra's in as well. Uh, probably want to get Cast Down in, I think. Get Command out. Get Aether Fairy out. Do we want to get. No, we want to get Tyrant Scorn out, not Teferi. Teferi's okay. Teferi's fine. Um, but we do want to get these Duresses in, I think. Fit Adobe's veto in there. I'm not so sure. No, I don't think I can. I'll go like this. Yeah, let's do that. Big hand, but we'll see what we get. <clears throat> oh, 
up to the bin so he doesn't get his turn one scry draw. Land off the top, which is nice. Keep having some of that, please. Take a duress instead. Got nothing else to do anyway, even though I draw another land, so I can burn a turn. Just absolutely tear his hand to shreds. Although I am kind of not doing anything. Uh, black sauce off the top goes great here. Ooh, not quite. Not quite. We got we got time to burn now, we got time to burn. Out of course. Unfortunately he's come across a draw spell. I was hoping he'd just flood out, but no luck, unfortunately. There's our black sauce. And we can go for Basilica. some life, gets him to discard something, probably that island. Yep, there we go. And then we just go again, shall we? So we've had, we've seen five discard spells so far. Which is insanely lucky. Like, that's just really, really lucky. Plus, we've managed to get the land out and we managed to get the basilicas out. Opt. I mean, he has so many draw spells, he can very easily recover from all of this. Let's see if we can get a Teferi out. Spell. He does. It's fine. Get that out before Teferi comes out. The big Teferi. <clears throat> Chart course, yeah. See, with things like Spell Pierce, you can do Spell Pierce, stop your momentum, draw a card, try and um, stabilize a bit. This is Crackling Drake. So we get a land now, we're good. Hey, there we go. Okay. This isn't a fight you need to take this. time out. He'll use his uh, bolt on the next turn to clear it, but that's fine. I can win him another turn anyway. <clears throat> also, I've got hostage taker, so I can remove a creature off the battlefield. Boom. We got a round. Third round. Good round. Yeah, it was. Yeah, yeah. Um, yeah, we, we, we overplayed there. We, like, absolutely crushed. <clears throat> two Duress, a Thought Erasure, two Basilica Bell Haunts, and a Big Teferi. And a Baby Teferi. Like, that's just... That's really good. Not perfect, but it's something. He's gone down to six. Five. Five and he scries. Okay. And he gets to the he gets to play as well, so. in a gate to the bin. Okay. So he must have a spell pierce of some description, I think. So I think I might try and go to Fairy first. Oh, so he's got a negate in hand. Yeah, he's got a negate in hand. Um, so I'm going to go to Fairy first because I kind of put more emphasis on the Narset. Uh, this will draw out the negate. There we go. So that's two negates out of his deck on. And he's probably, yeah, he's land flooded, so he's probably going to try and. Do we see if we get another one? There we 
go. Mind and body should move in unison. Um, I'm not actually going to trigger this because I don't want him to like get a draw spell and then be able to use it. And I don't want him to be able to bolt this and get it off the field first. Your move, mate. What's your move? Because my move's windmilling to fairy on the next turn. I assume he had a draw spell that he wanted to use. He did. He had a, he had draw spells in hand that he was going to use to cycle through his deck, um, and that just absolutely locked him down because he only had two mana. <clears throat> GG. Wand of Vertebrae. Top card of your library into your graveyard. Exile the wand, pay two, tap it, and shovel up to five cards from your graveyard into your library. Okay, fair enough. Interesting card. Right, who's the gatekeeper? Is it Dreadhard? I bet it's Dreadhard. <laughs> oh god, please don't let it be Dreadhard. Three matches, 3-0, three fair and square. Doing well, making some good plays, solid plays. <clears throat> the bodyguard guy from the meme, yeah. <laughs> Got the skills, let's do it. Uh, I'll take this. We're on the play, so we can keep... Um, we can keep... Like keep up the tempo here, get the early hero down. Hopefully he's not mono red. He goes to six. Big man pulling out wins. Yeah. Hopefully we uh keep that momentum going. Get this out tapped and then go drank out to give into hero. Please don't be red deck wins. He's not red deck wins, he might be dread horde. Or he might be reclamation. Three cost spell off the top would be really nice, even if it's just an Oath of Kaya, just to keep some tempo going. Paradise Druid, sure. Oath of Kaya will do. Um, if he trades with the Paradise Druid, I'm happy with that. Because it just stops him ramping. He does not. Uh, he's playing black, so he's probably Dreadhard. That Oath of Kyra off the top prediction was pretty good, right? Ah, so he, he, Vraska's a minus three, he's the hero, unfortunately. But, that means we can kill it with, uh, with this. Um, and we drew another Oath of Kaya, so that's good. Pretty efficient, that. If we get another land off the top, we can just slam to fairy. People usually get rid of the hero. Um, I, I did a little bit of research against this deck, and, and hero kind of like just really needs to outpace um, Dreadhorde. It really needs to just get in there early, get this early damage down like we've done, and um, try and disrupt the ramp and stuff like that because obviously the lower health you get them the harder it is for them to get like combos and stuff from Dreadhorde going because they have to pay the life first before they can get any life gain off of it. Uh, land off the top does really well here because we can just tuck this and, um, and get this token through again. You get to land off the top which he probably wants to play. Yeah, 
every little bit of damage counts here. Right on schedule. I'm not ready for this quite yet. There's his five land. He's got his wild growth walker. Yeah. And his jade lights. We get another land off the top. We just go Liliana and sacrifice creature. Here. Keep up the pace. Land. That is land. <laughs> My army will envelop this world. Uh, that's probably not what we want to do, right? We probably don't want to sacrifice this thing. This thing's going to get huge, but we can still block it. We want to make tokens. Putrid, but Realistically. Effective. And we have another Teferi, so we want to try and keep. Uh, we want to try and keep Liliana alive and get the tokens on her. He's got something. Okay. Trade with one of these, draw a couple of cards, re refuel our hand a bit. Has he got Elder Spell? There's no way he's got Elder Spell, right? He's got Tamiyo. Uh, sure. What's he got in his graveyard? Oh, okay, so he's going to return Vraska. Every story is an opportunity for new data. Let me aid your research. Got command. Actually, going to put this back to his hand because I don't want him comboing it. I want him to have to actually play it. Um, no time for a break. Good help is easy to find in war. So I think we can play Teferi here. And then uh, put back Oath of Kaya, shoot him in the face, use this as a blocker, and then um, untap two in his next step and despark Tamiyo. I will not stand for such violence. Put full control back. Pass. This is pretty nerve wracking. You 
can only play stuff at sorcery. Yep. That's fine. So he gains a bit of life. Goes back up to 17. And then he's got his two. Uh, so let's see. We get plus one this. See what we let's get off. It. Do we want to tug to fairy? Do you want to tug something? What's he going to bring back? There's nothing there that can kill my Liliana. Minus three this guy. Time is much more malleable than people think. Let's slow this down. You know what? I'm not done yet. Wow, this looks like a fun new toy. I didn't really need to say to life uh it's a bit of a mistake. So the Jade Light Ranger is only at a 3-2. That's not too bad. I can deal with that with the blocks. It's the rest of the stuff that I need to deal with. And I've managed to get rid of his um, his healing card. Which I don't think he has anything to get out of the deck. <clears throat> So he can pull back. Ah, oh, he can pull back my big Teferi. Ah, oh, no, 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 no. God damn it. Yeah. I'm known for my excellent time. I leave dead bodies wherever I go. Ready to join them. So he'll tuck the Liliana, I think. <clears throat> That's a bit of a shame. Uh, I was just, I was like one turn off getting that. Okay. Um I know my responsibility. Think we won this. Oh, I've done the hero thing before. Yeah, that's what I'm going to try to do anyway. I'm just going to double check, make sure he doesn't have anything. Yeah, there we go. But yeah, it was Aethercai to the face. I was just concerned that maybe he had something that 
I didn't know about. <clears throat> okay. Um, heroes stay in. Mortify can probably go. It's probably not that good. And I think Narsets can go too. Maybe it's a fairy actually. Go D Spark. Um, get the Jurasses in. Get the Veto in. The Liliana out and the other Dread Horde in, so we can do do the Dread Horde business. Um, Tyrant Scorn can probably stay in, I think. So this is probably what I'm going to go for. Narset's powerful bit is that she stops people from drawing cards, but he doesn't really draw cards. He like filters through and picks them out. I think... Maybe only one Jurass, actually, because we've seen this backfire before. <laughs> yeah, Oath and... Yeah, you could do that, yeah. Oath and Double Oath. Yeah, that's a fair point. Um, I'm actually going to take a Kaya's Wrath, just in case. Just in case. <clears throat> we only need one for when he, like, does that big, you know, big combo. Okay, let's keep this. <clears throat> He's gone to five. No way! Did I just get to diamond again? Holy shit! <laughs> Thanks, my dude! <laughs> Oh my god, I, fa I feel like just like a weight has been lifted off my shoulders, I got a little bit of luck, and finally, finally up there. Whew! <laughs> oh shit, I was shitting myself about that second round then. Four for four, that's four for four today, yeah, yeah. A um, little bit of luck on that last one, but every every round we've played apart from that last one, we've done really well in. Um, made some really strong plays. Um, have I lost a round yet? I think I've lost one round at least, haven't I? I did have MTG Arena Tula, but it seems to have gone. Uh, all events run constructed. Current season. <clears throat> Uh, yeah, so we lost the round against uh, Is It Drakes, and that's it. That's the only round we've lost today. So yeah, four for four. We're on thirty-eight, thirty-four percent on the play. We're up to after winning a couple of matches earlier on. Um, that was up from thirty percent, and uh, seventy-eight percent win ratio on the draw. So it reckons. Uh, We've got 351 games until Mythic, if we keep it keep at the same pace. But it also thought it was going to take me 87 games to get to Diamond, and it took me five more, four more games. Well, five because I won one at the end of yesterday. When I didn't, I didn't check at the end of yesterday. I checked, uh, I think, before the last match. Yes, get the Zens in the chat. If you sub, you can use the Zen emote. It's me and Zenyata with the magic colours. I think it's boss. <laughs> get the get the bagel emotes in here. <clears throat> wow! And we overcame Dreadhorde to get to to get to Diamond. How fitting is that, man? Yeah, I'm happy with that. I'm super happy with that. Right.
17,900 gold as well. I will state I called it. Did you call it? Sorry, I must I must have missed that. Or did you mean last night? When we were chatting. <clears throat> Got a bunch, bunch of wild cards to use when the new set comes out. Probably won't get too much from M20. Said you got this. <laughs> Thank you very much. I appreciate that. Right. Let's go into Diamond 4. Why did those two basilicas swap? <laughs> they swapped when I picked the hand. Does it say if I does it count if I say you can get mythic and do it in two years? Yes it counts. Yes. Definitely. Hundred percent. Anyone who backs me to get mythic, it counts. I appreciate all the support no matter how long ago it was. Playing Dreadhorde again. Uh, we, we haven't got enough pace to drop his life down. So we will ho hopefully he will tap this, yes. Um, he gets his... He gains one life, he gets his Tamiyo, and then I will Tyrant Scorn the Pi Paradise Druid, even though he's pretty much got there. He'll be looking for command now. Get Mythic an Artifact. <laughs> Oh, he's looking for the Ra Raska Golgari Queen. Okay, sure. Put that out of commission. Land off the top. That allows us to play um, Basilica. Uh, I think I probably want to probably want to Elder Spell this now. Before he gets Raska. Five days to hit Mythic and you scared from your job this week, yeah. <laughs> okay, he's just got a second Tamiyo. It's, it's all good. Command the Dreadhorde is there. What is this? Has he got Bolus there? Oh, so he can just command the Dreadhorde Bolus. Very nice. I like that play. Could this be Dreadhorde? He might pull something back to his hand here. I have learned Pulls. Much from my ancestors. Oh, okay, yeah. So this is where he gets his red from. Uh, I'm going to call it there on that one, I think. Um, well, uh, this is not too bad. We can, we, can, we can still do something. All stories must end. This isn't the worst thing ever. Like, he will get us to sacrifice something, but I can get rid of that swamp. Uh, oh, I'd probably just get rid of both of the Kaya for Oh god, watch me draw a baby to fairy now. Oh, he's got triple Tamiyo, boys! The old triple Tamiyo with all the landy weeds! Pulls the command back. Yeah. Never never mind the power of thought erasure, right? Who needs thought erasure when you can just play triple Tamiyo? Yeah, we'll we'll concede there. We'll concede. That's a pretty strong build. I like putting that planeswalker land down just for that any colour red. So you can pull Bolas back. Or you can even just pull him back with Dreadhorde. Pretty sweet that. Um so probably key Tyrant Scorn in um Command in there. Take Mortify out. D Spark. Into the God Eternals, Jurass. We need to get Dervin's Veto in, really, don't we? Um, the heroes out. <coughs> we shouldn't really take the heroes out. We should keep the heroes in.
How do I play this? What do I want to get rid of? Um, maybe get rid of one big Teferi. No, I, I, think, I think maybe we get rid of Hero here. One baby. Put in. Yes. What do I? What do I put in? Oh, let's put a big one back in now. Let's go for a little one. Yeah. <clears throat> I think, because I can experiment now because I can't go back down, I, I think the right move here, it was to keep the heroes in, but I want to try it without the heroes and see if that really was, like, the mistake that I was making as such. Dreadhorde. One Tamiyo to the bin, which is he's at least got multiple in hand. My notes helpful. Can't play Narsa yet, I haven't got my second blue sauce. He's got the duress. Um, there's the second blue sauce. Veto for this duress, probably. You could use some manners. It did something. Maybe that's why we need two in, is for Dreadhorde. So of how powerful it is. Oh, he puts the fairy to the pin. Oh, god damn. Double duress. See, See look, what's he gonna look for? He's gotta look for Dreadhorde now, hasn't he? This is Dreadhorde time. His build is mega good. Like, seriously good. Very impressive. I know 88 ways to keep an open mind. I have become too involved with my work. So we'll see where he's got another one. Uh, he's doing some precise land tapping here. Okay, sure. So he's got something else. There's the Vraska on top. Oh. Okay. Sure. Meditate and prepare. Maybe he already has Dreadhard in hand. Probably does, doesn't he? Rasker on top, yeah. Sure. Might be a bad idea. I 
have practiced against many foes. Put thoughtfulness before action. Dreadhorde? Yeah, he's got oh, he's got bloody Dreadhorde in hand, hasn't he? God damn it. Oh, God. Just so... This, this is what normally happens against Dreadhorde, is I just can't keep up. I just can't, like, get there. They just seem to explode out the gate with all this ramp and then be able to find the cards that they need to sustain. There he is. You would make an yep. excellent informant for my study. It's such an interesting build, this though, to have Playcrafter in there. GG, my dude. It's only a matter of time. GG. Just got that second command in hand. Um, so we'll just take a knee there. Think I've probably got to get the second Dovin's Veto back in the deck. <clears throat> I like the one hostage taker. I like the end of the God Eternals. I think maybe two Jurassic is too much. Two Dovin's Veto might be better. Because we already have the four... We've got eight discard already in the deck. Um, and that takes us to nine. <clears throat> I'm not particularly sold on this cast down anymore either. I just never seem to bring it in. So I think I'm going to cut that. Um... What else have I got that I can put in? Um, I'll run in my cyborg IRL. Ugin, maybe? Control card this. It's kind of really slow paced. But could that be enough just to just to win against Dreadhorde on the odd occasion? Is one even worth it? Like if you draw that, you you win against Dreadhorde. There is no he has no other win condition, really. That guy had Bolas, but not many people run Bolas. Do not have an unremorred ego in real life, but maybe I just try it and see whether it works. So, yeah, I'm going to do that. I'm going to do that. So, we've gone up to two Dovin's Vito and we've got an unremorred ego in the sideboard. That will come in against uh, dread things like Dreadhorde. Um, Esper Control works against as well because you just go to Fairy and rip them all out of the deck. Um, export. Just gonna import any up. <coughs> It's 
screen is Black Twitch is bugging. Uh, might be. Let me just check the Twitch, mate. How are you doing, Stoke, by the way? You doing good? Uh, yep, looks like your Twitch is bugging. I can see myself on screen. <clears throat> Let's save that. Unmod Ego. Let's give it another try. Another whirl. Because I feel like it would be pretty powerful against those kind of decks that rely on just the one card. First loss of the night, though. Against the deck that I struggle against the most. Stokes says, good mate, taking a break at work. Let me restart my Twitch. Good stuff, mate. Good stuff. Ray-Ban, man. Oakley's are better. Right. <clears throat> he goes to five, uh, to six, rather. He goes to five. <laughs> or should we leave that on the play? I'm going to go for the Godless Shine. I think this thought erasure out turn two. See what we've got here. We've got a Tyrant Scorn, we've got Hostage Shaker, we've got Dread Horde Butcher, so some kind of Grixis Aggro. I think. Get rid of one of them. Othakaya stays on the top. That's really good. That will just clean him up. Clean that second one up. Very nicely. He will get a counter. And he will shoot us for two. But that's just... I mean, that's his job. That's what he does. Um, so I think we will play the planes rather than taking the two life here. deal two damage to us. And that'll just keep that in check a little bit. And then we can play the Hallowed Fountain out tapped and play to Fairy you know, next turn. It's no, no problemo. Let's go. I can no longer stand by and watch. I think I'll probably tick this up. Let's try this. <clears throat> Until he has something that he drops because he's going to have some kind of creatures. Ooh, Bolus. Bolus. Okay, uh, probably just get rid of both Kaya here, I think, because it's not really going to do me any good. Here, a precinct off the top. Despark this. Both Kaya left Trust hand, or a card. Play the last land, then we can play Teferi on the next turn. One. Go one down. Get the Teferi down. Go, 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 go. And we'll tuck, tuck this bolus. What's the shaker? Takes hero precinct. Draw a card first, see what we get. Hurry! Just a land, unfortunately. Um, I think. I think I do want to. Oh, Here we go. Get my creature back. Oh, look at that! Absolute beauty. An extra token. You show remorse. Plus one. Get this line down. Attack for two. What a top deck. So he's got one more until that big bolus comes smashing down, getting me to discard something. Time it scorns. Kind of expected that. 
Uh, so parts are fails, yeah. Those who cannot perceive beyond the veil of reality. Um So we can't we have to get rid of this with the other Teferi. We can't get a card off of this one and we can't tuck with this one. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna plus one anyway. We won't get a card oh, off it, but we will get you know, we'll get to undo two lands. You need to take a time out. That's more like it. And then we'll get uh, <clears throat> two back. Now, this also makes his um, bowlers not so great. Because I haven't got anything to discard. And I've got plenty of lands to play anything that comes up. Um, so I think we'll we'll plus one this. We need to move quickly. I think the best move here is to just thought erasure. I probably should have done thought erasure first and surveilled, but at least we can get rid of this now. Um, yeah, there we go. GG. Nothing left point at the top of the deck. Nice timing on my thought erasure that I know. Yeah, I was like, uh, probably should have done that first. <laughs> um, so, we need to probably drop hero because he'll board in his Cry the Carnariums, as they normally do. We probably want to get rid of Tyrant's Scorn. We'll put our Duress in. We'll put our Dovin's Vetoes in, our D Sparks, enter the God Eternals. And we'll put in on Mardigo because we can get rid of a Bolas. And I think we'll get rid of Lily and go double double commander dreadhorde. Mortify will probably stay in there. Um I think I'll go minus one Basilica, plus one Hostage Taker. And then, do I want to try and get a Lyra in here? I don't think that's wise. I don't think a Lyra is wise. We have enough removal for any creatures that come down. Um, I think I probably want to try and get the Elder Spell in there though, right? Drop down one to fairy and get the extra elder spell in there, just in case. Actually, yeah, yeah, because Tef maybe to fairy's not so good against this deck, right? Because we don't want to keep bouncing baby baby ballers. Uh, yeah, let's go. <laughs> yeah, that timing was shocking. <laughs> He did start on five in that game. This is a land heavy hand, but we'll see how we'll see where it gets us. We've got a game to spare. Uh, there's an elder spell out, nice and early, which is good. Can use mortify on um, Bolus, just fine. Mort erasure, okay. That'll probably get rid of the Narset. Sorry, didn't mean to knock my mic there. Okay, so he's got plenty of lands in hand, we know that. Because <clears throat> he's just put one to the bin. So he's not interested in any more lands, but he might have double thought erasure. He does. I kind of I kind of had an inkling he might do this. Mortify goes. Oh, 
always seems to be that second game against Grixis where they like smash out all the hand disruption. Bit of like Esper really. Come on then. Let's see this bolus. There we go. Drop a isolated chaplain. and like just essentially nullify a turn of da damage probably not the greatest thing to do ever but <coughs> oh okay I didn't know they played dread horde invasion these days fair play fair play <laughs> triple thought erasure come on the dread horde goes um, can't really see how we come away from a, a triple thought erasure game to be honest but that will be a good start. I mean, that's top deck and a half. Plenty of removal gone there as well. Oh, we got rid of two. Two boluses. Nice. We got Khan. Uh, if we got, like, a baby Teferi off the top here... You can have that one. Um, if we got a baby Teferi off the top here, that would be absolutely disgusting. Because we can bounce the token, kill the Khan. Uh, that's a shame. Big Teferi. Trust me. You'll thank. Let's skip to the good part. We, we, we don't want to tuck that, really. We want to, um... We want to just take the two, I think. Um... Oh, he's going to put... He's going to pull back Bolas anyway. So, it doesn't really matter. Maybe I should have put Calm back to the bin. That Elder Spell is going to go, unfortunately. Yep. Let's see what we can get next. Two damage, it's a fairy. Don't play. Him. Time for plan B. <clears throat> uh, I don't really want to tuck anything. Do I? I've lost one of my commands. Do I think I can draw something? I have to, right? I have to draw something. Otherwise, he just takes over with Khan and tokens. I have to draw removal. Keep up the pace. <laughs> yes, yes. See you, dude. Uh, yeah, the, uh, three three thought erasures. Probably wasn't going to come back from that. So, I think we'll go again. Um, let's see what we can do. I don't think the Oath of Kyra is so good here, so I'm going to um, put in a Kaya's Wrath. On Kaya's Wrath, just in case, because now we know he's playing Dread Horde Invasion. I can just kind of like hold that in hand until the board gets the board state gets too much. God no. That's better. Keep six. To ferry on top will do. These lands down. Uh, 
I just got double thought erasure in hand again. Uh, yeah, we'll take the land on top. So he'll get rid of Teferi here. I don't think he's interested in seeing that come down. Uh, but we got rid of one, which is good. Hopefully we shouldn't see two. Ah, uh, we do. So he's he's played two games back to back and got three back to back uh, thought erasures. So six in total, which is fun. Um, yeah, pretty pretty juicy that. These are the kind of games you just don't win, unfortunately. That's just some badass luck there. So what do we see now? Two Dreadhold Butcher, yeah. Hits us for, for one. Uh, actually, I'm, I'm actually going to go for this, to be honest. I'm going to go for this because... I think, yeah, he's going to use a Tyrant Scorn on it to pull it back to his hand, I think. Yeah, yeah I had a feeling he might do that. Get it with Earth Kyres on the next turn. Oh, okay. Okay. This is probably just a Kaya's Wrath, just to try and get both of them if I get... Oh, I did not get a land off the top. Really not doing well here. He's outpacing me pretty heavy. Haven't even got the mana up for Dalian's Veto. He can play big bowlers now. Being able to get rid of this Dreadhorde Butcher is a bit of a nightmare, actually. Just haven't been able to draw into that other black source that I need. Well, there it is. That's good. Counter spell? Just this bedevil. It's just for four. Yeah, gotta gotta get some like serious, serious life gain here now. I think. <sighs> okay, got the got the double D spark. We've seen all three D sparks now. How's it gone? Um, where where did you leave us, mate? Where did you leave us? My to tell me. Is I have just gone? Uh, we've been battered since we got a diamond, pretty much. There's ball of Dragon God. 4-0 I think, yeah, so we went 4-0, uh, got into Diamond, um, and then we've, ju we've just been crucified since we since we joined this league. Just can't seem to chain the draws together well enough. Seem oh, to be drawing no like multiples like this and then off cards which I don't actually need and not actually getting the, the filler cards really. <clears throat> Which is a And now he's got double Narset, so he can pretty much just draw into whatever he likes. Draws Ugin. So he's got Ugin and Bolas. Um, we can get rid of one of them here. Probably Bolas. I don't really want. I don't really mind if Ugin comes down. That's fine. We're going to need that at some point. Meditate and prepare. 
hold full control, see what he does. Do not defy the designs of an elder dragon. I wasn't sure whether I could get um, get the spell in before he activated his ability, but I think he holds priority, doesn't he? So. Yeah, and I will hold this D spark for Khan. <clears throat> Struggle to get rid of Narset. Need an oath, really, or a baby Teferi to bounce oath. What else has he got here? Oh. Bye bye. Bye bye, Deep Spark. I will fight for my You may regret that choice. Plenty of land, and I've got nothing. So sorry, I'm late. GG. Uh, considering um, Let's take it how much I beat him in the first game, I feel like I kind of got done in there by just not being able to to draw the cards that I wanted to draw. Um. Let's go again. <clears throat> I don't think I really because because in both games he saw like six thought erasures, I don't think I can really um take much from that game. Other than Thought Erasure is very, very strong. Blame on the shuffler. I blame the shuffler every day, I hate it man. I hate it. Not as much as I hate red deck wins, though. That thing needs to go immediately. Ooh, we can go for a. Oh, oh, go on, go on. Let's let's try and get the hero out. The early hero. He's got Thought Erasure? No, come on. Let me have it, let me have it. Let's get a second one out. Let's go. Come on, please don't have another th another one of these. No, don't remove it. Please don't remove it. Oh, good God. Fine. Get rid of something. Ooh, so he's got two Narset in hand. He's definitely got two Narset in hand, right? Okay, D Spark, yeah. Let's skip to the good part. Tyrant Scorn. So he got rid of. Okay, weird. Yeah, sure. Get rid of that. You don't do the reverse. He's got rid of all my stuff now. I'm gonna get rid of all of his. You know what? I'm not t done. T t t t t fairy. What have we got? Oh! I'll take it. That was much quicker. Much much quicker. Okay. What do we do in the mirror match? Do we take heroes out in the mirror match? Or do we keep them in? I don't really play against it that often. I'm 
just want to put all the single target removal in really don't we so we want to go uh, get the other elder spell in get one more d spark in I think I don't think we need I don't think we need more than two uh, what we do need to go I think Mortify can probably go put in Kai's Wrath Spark in here, put one D spark in. I don't need Kaya. Do I need Kaya's Wrath? I'm gonna win a chicken dinner. What a game one, I know. Just absolutely took him down. Yeah, I think we need Hostage Taker. Yeah, Hostage Taker's a good shout. Uh, we'll take one Basilica out for a Hostage Taker, and we'll take out, um, probably an Arsa. He doesn't really have that much draw, does he? It's just um, Big Teferi, and like a Big Teferi, Baby Teferi, like, just like we have, but he might have Elite Guard Mage, I guess. Go with that. Take more heroes. Yeah. Hostage taker down. Take the hero. No white for our hero here, but um, we've got thought erasure. And time it's gone. We can play time it's gone and thought erasure. He might do thought erasure now. Yep. So you'll have to trade one for one. He took a long time thinking about that. That's the longest I've any I've seen anyone think about whether they should trade a thought or ratio or not. I think he was genuinely considering it. Whew! Look at that. What a draw. Okay, what's he got? Dovian's Veto. He's got Teferi Time Raveler. And Narset. I think Narset's probably the most powerful, right? We probably want to get rid of that, I think. There's the land. There's the white source. That draw. Yeah. Stunk in that one. Sorry, I'm late. Nothing. Okay, we get an opportunity to get our uh, hero of precinct down here. He does have a spell for it, but we can only do so much, so. Yep. Don't worry. Does he, have his, does he have another white source? He's got a watery grave. He doesn't have another white source, though. Um. I don't want him to know what this last card is. He doesn't know that it's a land. Okay. Let me see a uh, Teferi. Let me see him now, sir. Unfortunately, can't get rid of them. Big Teferi. Uh. This is gonna get counted. But what can you do? He's just he's just got the perfect setup right now. I have just the trick for this. Elder spell. Wow. Damn. Okay. Don't worry. I got this. So we gotta get rid of to fairy. He hasn't got enough well, we to, to um Oh. Oh he didn't untap the right lands. He could have played this. 
and just cleaned up. What? Okay, fine. If you wish to surrender now, hone your Wow, really? <laughs> okay. Oh dear. This is hardly my work. Deary me. <laughs> so he draws planeswalkers off his, but I just whiff entirely. Three lands and a hero. Woo! Let's try this. No, mate. Should have played the other one first. I train every day. No one is meant to keep an open mind. Thought erasure. <laughs> this Kaya's Wrath has not come in handy, really, has it? To be honest. Meditate and prepare. Oh, big to fairy. Can we get it down? We can. If you show remorse, I'll show the straight. I'm not ready for this quite yet. I think this is probably Elder Spell comes out. This might be a bad idea. But he's got all the cards, all the setup. Um, all the removal. This is hardly my worst defeat. Warrior. But at least he didn't see. get it on Narset, which is fun. Take the draw. Ah, full control for the Thought Erasure to get rid of mine. Okay, yeah. Fair play. Fair play. If I could do something, that would be nice. I just feel like I've done nothing for the last... Umpteen turns. No, I am not making this up as I go. He's got another Teferi already. I'm no time for a break. Command the Dread Horde would be really nice. Concede then. She's just got full control over this. Absolute full control. Come on, give me something to do. I've got time. Yeah, I'm done. Just go to the next round. Um, Kaya's Wrath was utterly useless there, but I don't think it's such a bad thing having it in. I wonder if he took his heroes out. We didn't see his heroes, did we? We didn't see his heroes. wonder if he's just taken them out completely. Try something a little bit more controlly. <clears throat> I've hit my goal for the month, so I'm just gonna try and experiment with different sideboard and tactics. See what works. A handful of Teferi might work. I doubt it, but we'll see. did pay off in the end. Oh, I've done Gomez it. official now. Yes. Nice. Any transfer fees on that one or just the usual like keeping shit on. Here goes nothing. Twenty-five million euros. Nice. 
I should get used to fairy to bounce the hostage taker. That's more like it. <laughs> that that it, uh, a hostage taker has been out. Not a hostage taker, a hero has been out three turns and didn't produce a single token. Here we go. Didn't you mean Pan cut the deal? Yep, that's good. We will meet again. Of course, he had Elder Spell. Of course, he did. I know. Hold that thought. Does he have a secondary elder spell? Trust me, Does he I have not? a plan. <sighs> he knows I've got the hostage shaker. Daughter Asia, hey. So get rid of the hostage taker. Oh, okay, okay, sure. I mean, the Lilian is a huge threat, like, for sure. Hurry! But it does mean I'm going to be able to hostage take a pretty much free. Nice, but I guess he just puts it back to his hand, doesn't he? I've got it. Yeah, but we get we got rid of his Teferi in return, so it's fine. Who we? I can no longer stand you. Bad man. To slow down. Okay, so we want to baby Teferi and bounce that. Uh, That token to kill the fairy. Sorry, I'm late. Let's try this. Get that attack in while we can. Could actually play. Oh god! Wait, he says third to fair. No. Trust me. I've Keep played up the one. Pace. He's played one. What's he counting? What is he counting? This might be a bad idea. Okay. Only time. I thought he would have had like removal for that or something. Right on schedule. Hurry. Oosh. <laughs> the Dovin's veto off the top. That's a draw. <clears throat> Good veto, yeah, very good veto. Just in case he's... I mean, he's got a full hand. He could have Dreadhorde or anything in there. It will probably be a Thought Erasure. Um, I think we probably stop that from happening. We don't want to see that hit the field, really. <sighs> Maybe he's got Elder Spell. He might have Elder Spell. Oh, okay. Yeah, sure, fair enough. Let's play another. 
Hold that thought. Don't worry, I got this. What are these draws? Yeah, this is mad. No, we're, we're, I'm actually getting seriously good draws here. Shuffle winning me the game. Yeah, damn right it is. Damn right. <clears throat> Although I've still drawn an absurd amount of land. I've just used my cards pretty well. He's got uh, Dread Horde, hasn't he? He's, he's looking through my deck. He's Yeah, he's got Dread Horde. He's going to win. Fuck. Damn it. Trust me. You'll think if sorry I win, I'm late. I just surrender. Oh, I do love a good death oh. whale. I can actually win. I can win. Because I've got Baby Teferi in hand, so... I can win. He's got no more mana on. Shuffler. Thank you, Shuffler. GG. Uh, right, guys. I think I'm probably going to leave it there for the night. So, what did we do tonight? We got to Diamond. We got two notches into Diamond 4. We also... Where is my program gone? It's minimised itself. We also went... We did take a couple of losses. But we won 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 against 2. So 5 and 2 we went today. Yeah, 5-2, Baka. Really good run today. Way more positive attitude. Um, better selections and plays. Yes! Basic math, that's more than I've got, mate. It's more than I've got. Um... We also beat four color Dreadhorde. We lost to five color Dreadhorde, which is odd, but it worked really well. I was very impressed. And we beat, what else did we beat? Beat Esper Hero. We beat Izzet Drakes. We beat Simic Nexus. We beat another Izzet Drakes. Quite a variety of stuff there. Um, and then the usual, usual loss to, to Grixis as well. Um, so yeah, good night overall. Um, so yeah, I'll be back tomorrow, uh, same time, 7 o'clock, hopefully won't get in too late from work and be able to come on at 7 again. See you Baka, see you Waskell, see you Rusty, or Sink rather I should say, um, Memphos, and uh, Stoic if you're still in the chat mate, uh, thank you for coming out and supporting me, and I'll see you tomorrow, 7pm BST. Any of the new guys in the chat, if you like what you see, drop me a follow, put notifications on. Um, and I will see you tomorrow, same time. Cheers. Bye.